Hey there, and welcome back to our channel. Today's video is all about the personality disorders that are associated with female manipulation. And let me tell you, we've got some juicy stuff to cover. Now, before we dive into the nitty gritty details, let's just set the record straight. Not all women are manipulative. And not all women with personality disorders engage in manipulative behavior. However, it's no secret that women may be more likely than men to engage in manipulative behavior in certain situations. We'll be delving into two personality disorders that are commonly associated with manipulative behavior in women, borderline personality disorder and narcissistic personality disorder. But don't worry, we're not going to diagnose anyone. We'll leave that to the professionals. We'll be exploring the symptoms and characteristics of each disorder and discussing how they may contribute to manipulative behavior in women. So if you're ready to learn more about the link between personality disorders and female manipulation, sit back, relax, and let's get into it. Let's be honest. Not many people talk about this topic enough. It's always men manipulating women or men with serious problems trying to control their girlfriends. But as far as I know, men go through this psychological narcissistic abuse just as much as women do. It's a bummer. And let's face it, many dudes aren't exactly known for being open books when it comes to their emotions. They might feel embarrassed or ashamed about how they're feeling so they clam up and keep everything bottled inside. Let's be honest, we all know someone who has been in a manipulative relationship. It's like that bad horror movie where you want to scream at the victim for going down into the dark basement alone, but they just keep on going. So have you ever heard your partner say anything so absurd that it caused your eyes to roll back in your head to the point that you could see their brain? Something like, you're so lucky to have me, nobody else could ever love you as I do. Or, if you try to leave, I will do hurtful things to myself. Because if a woman you know exhibits any of these symptoms, she might be experiencing the effects of a personality disorder. We're not talking about just any personality dis disorder here. We're talking about borderline personality disorder and narcissistic personality disorder. These disorders can lead to manipulative behavior in women and those type of comments are just some of the red flags to look out for. Let's start with borderline personality disorder. We all have our quirks and personality traits that make us unique. However, some individuals may display more extreme and concerning patterns of behavior. Many women are afflicted by the mental health disease known as borderline personality disorder, BPD. And unfortunately, one of the ways BPD can manifest is through manipulative behavior. Before we delve into the serious topic of BPD and the manipulative behavior in women, let's take a moment to appreciate the absurdity of manipulation itself. Think about it. Manipulating someone is essentially trying to control their thoughts and actions to benefit themselves. It's like trying to play a real life game of The Sims with real people, except unlike The Sims, people have feelings, thoughts and emotions that are affected by manipulation. Okay, now, now that we've acknowledged the ridiculousness of manipulation, let's dive into the serious side of things. An emotional problem known as borderline personality disorder limits a person's capacity to control their emotions, which can result in impulsive conduct, fragile relationships, and a crippling dread of being abandoned. This fear of abandonment can often manifest its manipulative behavior towards their partner, family, or friends. So what does this manipulative behavior actually look like? Picture this. Your partner guilt trips you into staying with them, making you feel like you're the only thing keeping them alive. They might use emotional outbursts to get their way, like throwing a fit in public or threatening to break up with you over something very trivial. And if you try to leave, 
Watch out, because they might threaten self-harm or even suicide to keep you from leaving. But here's the thing. People with BPD aren't inherently bad or evil. They're just struggling with some intense emotions and a fear of abandonment. If this is happening in your relationship, then you might want to reevaluate. If you understand BPD in manipulative women, then let's move on to the narcissistic personality disorder. Ah, narcissistic personality disorder, the gift that keeps on giving, manipulative behavior. That's right, folks. When it comes to manipulation, NPD takes the cake. The classic me, myself, and I mentality of a narcissist. But what happens when this sense of self-importance starts to impact the relationships? That's when manipulative behavior can come into play. First, a little background. A mental illness knows, known as narcissistic personality disorder is characterized by an exaggerated feeling of self-importance, a desire for attention, and a lack of empathy for other people. People with NPD often believe they are superior to those around them and have a constant need for validation. So how does this translate into manipulative behavior in women? Well, it's simple. Narcissists believe they are a beating heart of the universe and they anticipate that others will agree with them. They use the typical love bombing, gaslighting, and guilt tripping combo. They often shower their partner with affection one moment, only to turn around and make them feel like they're doing, going crazy the next. And if that's not enough, they'll throw you in a healthy dose of emotional manipulation just to keep things interesting. Don't be fooled. This behavior isn't just a one-off thing. Narcissists need to maintain their sense of superiority at all times, so they'll keep up the manipulation tactics long after they've secured the relationship. And what happens if the other person tries to defend themselves? You guessed it, more guilt tripping and emotional manipulation. If you find yourself in a relationship with a woman who seems to think the world revolves around her, be on the lookout for these manipulative behaviors and remember, it's not you, it's her and her narcissistic personality. Also, if you're interested, there is another video about the narcissistic tactics women use on men to manipulate their partners that are uploaded on this channel, so you might want to check that out. Well folks, that's all for today's discussion on borderline personality disorder and narcissistic personality disorder causing manipulative behavior in women. While we've had a few chuckles, it's extremely important to realize that manipulating one's emotions in intimate relationships is not something to be taken lightly. Don't be afraid to ask for support if you or someone you know is being manipulated by another person. Always keep in mind that the foundation of a healthy relationship is not manipulation and control, but rather trust, respect, and communication. Stay cautious and safe. I sincerely appreciate you watching today's video. Hope you found it interesting. If you did, don't forget, or if you didn't, don't forget to click the subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. Until the next video, take care.